This is the 25th Los Angeles Uplifting Minds to Entertainment Conference. Hi, I'm Dr. Eunice Mosley. I founded Uplifting Minds in 1999 to educate aspiring artists about the business of entertainment and showcase their talents before a panel of experts. I'm going to hand you over now to our host for the conference, Vera Jones. Uh, she is a seasoned women's basketball commentator, as well as a motivational speaker. Some of her credits include ESPN and Fox. She's affectionately called the Empathy Coach. Vera? And thank you so much, Dr. Eunice Mobley, for allowing me to be here once again. If this is your first time attending, you are in for a unique treat. Very exciting entertainment. And we've got a few things that's going on here. Number one, you get awesome and very talent. Number two, the excellent insight and advice and all of the good education that you get from our world-class panelists. And number three, it's free. And I always say if it's free, it's for me, right? So I'm all over it. So you get an exciting Saturday afternoon of just enjoying some really good talent and getting a lot of education behind it as well. If you're interested in it today, uh, thank you to our sponsors. Um, and for those of you that are just tuning in, this is, and you're wondering, wait, is this the right place? Yes, this is Uplifting Minds 2. Um, and you're in the right place. Our sponsors include Freelance Associates. Uh, they uh, offer PR or business strategy, uh, some consultation for the winners of the competition. So thank you for that. Uplifting Minds 2 Foundation, of course, who gives up the cash prize, EURweb.com, Dr. Lee Bailey. Uh, I I go back as far as you go back because I remember when I started radio, uh, know exactly who you are and so pleased to know that you're here uh, and you're participating on the panel and giving that media exposure. 98.8 uh, FM on iHeart, that's Alanda Pulliam, who's also on the panel and is offering media exposure. LawyersRock.com, music business agreements to the winners. Very important, get that legal straight. Also want to thank TVS Records, Kids Gumdrop Performance, Hip Hop Jazz Records, who's offering Gregory Goodlow, who's on the panel. Uh, the Pulse of Entertainment.com, PR assistance to the winner. Also very important, got to get the word out. Natalie Jean Music is sponsoring Natalie Jean's performance. Zyla Records, Michelle Vreeland, who is on the panel and is also doing a, a performance. Hi, Michelle. Thank you. Uh, Imagination Lunchbox, International Film Festival. Uh, that's Anthony Hobbs, who will be on the panel uh, and is giving free admission to virtual open call uh, to all the winners. Uh, Aaron Aikens Music. Aaron Aikens is also on our panel. Divine Jams Gospel Music, Millie Prey's performance. Imagination Lunchbox. Launchbox LLC, Dr. Carrie Mosley Hobbs is on the panel. Superstar Entertainment, Artist Development Consult to the Works. Uh, Us Dim AFF Productions, who's offering studio time and track for the winners. The Word, W O R D Podcast, that is Dr. Winston Greer, who is also on the panel. Thank you. Uh, Mako Girls Entertainment, Michael O'Shea on the panel. Uh, Empire Records, that's Little Heist, who will be performing. Ace Design Music, that's for Ace's performance. And Angelic Music, uh, we have a professional panel. We'll also have some discussion, Q&A. So this is when I was talking about that education, this is where it all comes in. Good insight from our panelists. We have a professional showcase of artists who are signed to indie record labels, management companies, and agencies. So these are performers that are already out there. They're already performing. They're doing their thing. And they've graced us with their presence today. The third thing we'll do is the international talent competition. That is for singers, songwriters, dancers, or actors, where the top three scores win over $20,000 in product, services, and cash. One of our panelists, uh, Michelle Vreeland, who is a pop singer songwriter from Zyla Records, is going to perform for us. So we're not even going to make you torture you and make you continue to listen to me. We're going to jump right into the action right away. We're excited to hear again from Michelle Vreeland from Zyla Records. She'll be performing her latest single, Wild Horse. 
Michelle, it's all on you. Nice. Hang on. Thank you for that amazing. So I met Dr. Yunus um, with the release of this song, which was last year. And it's an important issue for me because I liken a wild ho horse to our free spirit. Remember when you were young and free, your dreams led you with energy to go to be what you were going to be. They gave you power, gave you strength, so why is your heart at arm's length to go to be to be to be? To be, meant to be. Oh, do yourself a favor. Listen to your heart again. It might surprise you. It might surprise you. Listen to your words in your head. The voice that's with you till you're dead. It might surprise you. It might surprise you. Wow. Wow. We had some audio feedback, but it was not lost on your beautiful voice. Thank you so much, uh, Michelle, for sharing that. That's beautiful. Yeah, well, I mean, here's what we're going to do. Our next phase right here is we're about to move into our panel discussion. In order to do that, just to make sure we're going to take care of two birds with one stone. One, we're going to make sure that everybody is actually here. Uh, let's start with Dr. Lee Bailey. Dr. Lee Bailey, are you here? Yes, I am here a little slow on the draw okay. because I had to figure out where the audio thingy was and then- All right, that's, that's why- Anyway, yeah, I'm here. All right, and since I'm calling on you real quick, any any advice, any, any advice as we get ready to start uh, our panels, our panels, excuse me, our talent showcases- Statement, nice to know that I've influenced someone and look how yeah. they turned out. <laughs> Yes, sir. Uh, the the bottom line is you just have to do you. I mean, we're going to find out what you're working with one way or the other. Uh, if you're qualified to be here, we're going to know. So <laughs> do you. If you think you're the, if you think you're all that, which you should, now's your chance to show it. I will move to our next panelist, Dr. Carrie Mosley Hobbs. I do see that you're here. If you could go ahead and mic up. I am. Um, Hello. How are you? I'm good. Can you offer a little bit of advice for our competitors today? Yeah, uh, probably my best advice to give you is to um, do the best that you can today. And I know some of you have been at Uplift Minds in the past, and I am an advocate of organic change and going where the flow leads you. So if there is a change, even in the song that you're doing and you are uh, motivated to make slight changes to it, a project and a piece of art is never finished. So follow your inspiration each way, each way that you go. Excellent. Thank you Thank very, you very much, much for that, Carrie. Uh, go ahead and mute. And then how about Aaron Aikens? Are you with us today? Aaron Aikens? From yes, I'm here. Oh, you are here. Aaron, can you offer some advice for us? For the performers, you've been working at whatever you've been working at. So do yourself a favor and don't get nervous before you try to transmit it to us. Just, you've been working at it, so just do what you've been working at. That's it. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm. Pastor Greer, Dr. Winston Greer. I believe you were on last year, is that true? Yes, ma'am, I was on last year and I am here today. 
my advice to the um, the ones that are performing, be confident in the gift that you believe that God has imparted in you. Be very confident in that, in that gift. Uh, be confident in your preparation. Uh, the word of God said uh, your gift should make room for you. So just be confident in the gift you believe that God has given you. Perfect. Perfect. I just left a conference, to, uh, a women's conference, church women's conference, and we talked a lot about that. Be bold. All right, Anthony Michael Hobbs, are you here? Anthony Michael Hobbs, founder of the Imagination yeah, Lunchbox. You are I'm here. here. Hi. Hi there. Can you please, um, uh, your mic is a little low, but um, if you could lean in just a little bit and offer some advice for our co competitors today. Uh, yeah, can you hear me better like this? Yes, that's perfect. Um, uh, my best piece of advice is, um, if you're nervous, then honestly, that's a good thing. You wouldn't be human if you wasn't nervous. Um, but I would say just use those nerves to the best, best of your abilities. Make sure, you know, this is your chance to, you know, you know, make a, make, make a break, make a big break. So you got to capitalize on it. Um, you know, use those nerves as, as fuel and motivation. Don't let them get the best of you. Perfect. Thank you very much. Also great advice. Uh, and as uh, someone who coaches speakers and 75, almost 75% of people say that they have public speaking fear. So uh, that's one of them. Let the nerves work for you, right? Good advice. Michael O'Shea, artist manager, president of Mako Girls Entertainment. Michael, are you here? Yes, I am here. How are you doing Hi, today? Michael. I'm good. Am I saying your right last name correctly? It's Ochoa. Ochoa. Thank yes. you. You couldn't make that easy for me, huh? Yes, very easy. <laughs> I would say to all the artists performing today to just leave it all out on the on, in your performance. Uh, you know, just enjoy what you do and embody your song and whatever your craft is, and it will show. Perfect. Appreciate that. Michelle, you already have jumped in and uh, started singing with us. If you would be kind enough just to share your advice, especially now that you have already performed. Yes. So as someone who has um, severe stage fright and I've had to work very, very hard to work through that and to you learn how to utilize my nerves and all of that stuff i would say surrendering to the music and surrendering mm. to something that is bigger than you is something that can get you through pushing through the moment and nervousness actually means you're doing the right thing at the right place at the right time i like that if you remember that as you're performing, you're going to get better and better and better and better each and every time. So. Great advice. Great advice. The stage fright is just a little bit of adrenaline and cortisol going through right? the going through the system. That's all it is. Human nature. All right. Thank you, Gregory Goodlow, jazz guitarist. Gregory, you here? I thought I saw you. Yeah, there you are. You entered the room. Greg, if you would just unmute and just share with us uh, your Best advice. Hi, everybody. Can you hear me? Hello. Yes. Uh, my best advice, <clears throat> and I still use it, is the three P's. Practice, patience, and perseverance. Those are three principles that I continue to use and I always go to whenever I need uh, to move myself forward in my career or whether I'm practicing my instrument or seeking uh, new avenues. Thank you. Thank you very much. I like those three Ps. I use those myself. Okay. Alander Pulliam Jr., the owner of 98.8 FM, iHeart Radio. Alander, are you with us? I am here. I am here. Hi, Alander. You've yes. been around for a, a while. Give us some good advice. These artists that are stepping on stage here with us at the Uplifting 2 
at Uplifting Minds to showcase? Yeah, it's some good advice. Personally, from experience, from me having to do public speaking, also running for president of the United States and having to face those those inhibitions, is breaking those inhibitions by, you know, being secure within your craft and your art, being secure within yourself, right? Um, understanding the practice is, is, is definitely a necessity to becoming more confident in what you're doing, right? And, you know, uh, be consistent in your practice of, you know, uh, becoming, I guess, comfortable with your craft. And in the more comfortable you become with your craft, just like writing and anything like that, um, I worked six years at Universal Music Group, and that was one of my things with artist development when that was existing is, you know, being comfortable and confident. And that's a lot of times where people are shy or are, and, and get more experiences with, with, with practicing with different, with different elements and stuff like that as well to kind of like, you know, get yourself comfortable with, with you know, making mistakes and working through them and using them as lessons and things like that. And just breaking that nervousness, using those tactics. Um, you know, that's one piece of advice that I would give to them. So. That's excellent advice. I had no idea. Uh, Dr. Mosley, you did not share with us. We had someone who ran for the president of the United States on our panel today. I, I'm going to need a moment. I need a moment, like just to take it all in. <laughs> I, I was telling everybody and their mother, vote for him. <laughs> yeah, you didn't tell me. Well, I didn't get out here. So yeah, it didn't make it to Florida. Yeah. Thank you for that, though. Wow. Thank you for that advice. And thank you to all of you. We should have now uh, had a chance to tap into all of our panelists. If I missed anyone, feel free to open your mic real quick but I believe I got all of the panelists that I had listed. All right, silence is golden. We'll move on then. Um, at this space, I wanna just thank everybody, first of all, for offering this advice because it means so very much. And like I said, one of the things that I know from hosting this last year that I took away was just being able to listen to all of you on top of all of the great talent. So thank you for that. Um, for our professional showcase, uh, I want to get excited. Those of you that were with us last year, you already have had a taste of hearing from this artist. But those of you who aren't or uh, were not with us last year, you're in for a real treat. Uh, the competition with rapper Lil Heist, Global Music Award winning song singer and songwriter, Natalie Jean and rapper Lil Heist. Actually, we, we heard from last year and he continues to um, just blow it up. And uh, I believe he's going to be one of the ones that kicks it off here. So our sponsors for the professional showcase are Empire Records, Natalie Jean Music, and Ace Designs. Our first act, as I said, is rapper Lil Heist performing his hit single, Up. He's signed to Empire Records. Lil Heist is a multi-award winning Uplifting Minds 2 competitor and we are so excited to hear from you again little heist the stage is yours here how everybody doing i just left the spot we didn't left the ceiling high no i cannot dance but i know they did it by when i cop a million i'ma drop the ceiling top if it ain't about hell and business baby please don't hit my line we the main attraction we done gotta start it Chris sit the baby whatever you call it we gonna make a movie rock star holly i think i need meds i keep going retarded my part and i go up i go up I go up, 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 say, boy, stop. Look, look, ain't no way around, we'll be coming to the spot. I'm a trans, I didn't nobody do it better. You better get a two boy, I got a game on lock, blast off like speed. Looking back, we only see better days. We going straight for throttle, ain't no time to break, Nessa. We gon' push the gas, we gon' straight up blast. Yes, Lord, just yes, everything that I work for, I earn for. I go up, yeah, I go up, I go up, I go up, I go up, yeah, I go up, I go up, yeah, I go up, 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 big ball, big plan, big. 
moves, yeah, yeah. New sounds, new way, follow soon, yeah, yeah. We turned up, never turned down, this ain't no news. I ain't talk crowd, but I can make a crowd move, move. Get like Steve on me, I'm the voice you miss, homie. I done put a whole lot of hours in, listen, y'all, I'm different, homie. I got a whole different vision, homie. Make room, make way. I ain't had to talk about how much money I got to make it so great, I swear, man, I go, what? Yeah, I go up, I go up, I go up. Yeah, I go up, I go up, yeah, I go up. Yeah, I go up, 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 I go up. It's over? I was just getting out. What? Oh, okay. All right. I, I, <laughs> it ended too soon. I was <laughs> I was about pop, ready to get my pop lock on. Yeah. Oh, okay. I'm like somebody's <laughs> old auntie, man. I enjoyed that. Thank you so much, little Mike. Thank you. Now, I'm going to say that's it. Listen, listen. I'm going to say that's uh, it because it's on my playlist. I told little Heist last time that I was going to go buy it. So I was up here singing it with you, man. I'm with it. Yeah, no, that's up, up. I like it. I like it. Thank you so much for that. I got caught up. Um, man, this is, like I said, you're in for a real treat. I know last year I... I thoroughly thoroughly enjoyed this i didn't know what to expect this year i have expectations so i was ready i got my shoulders out so i can pop them in the screen all right next up uh we want to introduce our next act natalie jean is going to be performing her new single my body no one's gonna tell me how to live my life. This body is mine. My choice to make. I'm the one who knows what to have to take. They can try to shame me, hold me down, but I'm rising up. Won't turn around. I've got the power in my hands. The warrior. Again, audio issues. However, wow. Yeah. You feel it regardless. I you agree. Feel you feel your energy. Thank you. Yes. Yes. Thank you very much, Natalie Jean. I want to close off and thank again, Little Heist and Natalie Jean for their performances in our professional showcase. And we're going to get ready now as we move into our international talent competition which is coming up next. Now, first and foremost, I need to announce to all of the judges and panelists how the scoring goes. You're probably familiar, but I wanna make sure it's very, very clear to everyone exactly how we'll do this. Uh, the scoring will go are for the top three acts. Panelists are going to score each act from one to five, with five being the highest, one being not, not so great, right? Uh, for each category, which includes song selection, Song content, delivery or performance, showman's, uh, showmanship, or style. At the end, judges will text us the top three scored acts. You should have received the information of where you are sending that text. Do I need to clarify any more, Dr. Mosley? Do they have the information of where they're texting? Yes, I have a text group, so hopefully uh, they can send it there. If not, they can send it through this Zoom chat, either way. Okay, all right, okay, sounds good. So once again, five being the highest, one being the lowest, you have several categories, song selection or song content, delivery or performance, and showmanship or style. So three categories. Uh, and once again, at the end, you're going to text. To get the competition started, uh, I'm gonna announce the first act as Shambika Banda from North Zambia. We are global with this thing. I hope I said your name correct. Shambika, are you here? He keep, If he doesn't answer, he keeps dropping off. He did that last okay. time, uh, but we're going to keep coming back to him. I will text you, I guess, when I see him pop in. But he okay. keeps popping in and out, so bear with him. Okay. All right, what we'll do is if he does pop back in, we'll put him into the rotation 
uh, somewhere, but we'll keep the show moving on. After each performance, by the way, we will be reaching out and looking for comments from our panelists and judges. All right, we do wanna get that feedback. It's very, very important for the artists. So next up, um, how about Millie Praise? I know I've seen Millie Praise. In fact, yep, I'm looking right at you. I see you. Thank you for being on, Millie. Be sure to unmute. Millie hails from Texas and we look forward. No, am I saying that right? Yes, from Texas. So please, Millie Praise. Take the stage. All right, sure. Thank make, you. Make good. Also, Thank you so much for having me here. I want to say a shout out to Divine James for this opportunity as well. Thank you. And the song I would like to minister is Sounds of Heaven. Can I be heard, please? I hear the sounds of the heavens. Now start to rest by your day. Ooh, I hear the voice of the angels. The voice says to magnify your day. It's no I hear the sounds of the heaven, the sounds that glorify your name. Oh, you are holy, holy. Amen. Amen. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Amen. When it's of the divine, um, it's almost like you don't even have to hear it. I don't know. That's just my thoughts. There are some professionals out there that are way more experienced than I. So let's get their feedback. I'd love to start with Dr. Greer, uh, host of the Word podcast, uh, also a pastor and an author that I'm sure Millie can offer you some, some great um, feedback. If you would, Dr. Greer. Yes, um, the audio uh, was uh, a bit challenging, but you could tell from uh, watching uh, my recommendation, just keep pushing and keep going hard, keep going hard. Okay, thank you very much. Um, I'm gonna ask each of the uh, panelists just to give a little bit of feedback there. Dr. Lee Bailey, I'm back to you. Get all my doctors out of the way. <laughs> um, I, 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 the, 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 I, I agree that the passion was there. I mean, I had no idea what she was singing for the most part, but I could feel it. No doubt about it. Dr. Carrie Mosley, can you, can you help us? Yeah, just quick. So I would agree with Lee. I was um, uh, trying to get with the audio and what I could hear. I could tell that you know how to sing. And I always admire people who know how to sing because I couldn't hold a note if it was in a bag in a box. <laughs> so, um, Michelle, you had some of uh, uh, some of the same audio issues. Aside from the audio issues, can you give a little feedback for Millie? Oh yeah, <laughs> yeah. I you know what's funny is um, I understand what you guys are saying about the audio. I know um, I'm. I need to upgrade my computer. I, I have a DAW and all that stuff, um, but it's at like capacity. So I'm one of those where it's time for me to retire my computer and get a whole new mm -hmm. rig. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I've, I've looked into extensively and maybe Little Heist has probably got the easier route. Uh, I wish I was at that meeting. <laughs> like, <laughs> Thank you for that, Michelle. Thank yeah. you. Uh -huh. And I'll go with Michael Ochoa. Um, you manage artists. A little feedback from Millie. Okay, there you go. Uh, yes, I am going to agree with Michelle the same way. Uh, that's what I tell my artists is one thing is to know where you're performing or who you're performing for at least, and then you select your music accordingly. But uh, for audio reasons, um, I use OBS Studios whenever we do Zoom and in order to get at least almost 89 percent to hear exactly what your audio would sound like when it's recorded aaron akins can you share with us yes um so 
one of the main things for me, Millie, is passion in the voice, just passion in the voice. So you had that. That was a good thing. Um, the thing is that I'm a professional singer, so I've had many uh, struggles with sound men in clubs. I, In other words, if you're singing to an audience, the main thing you want is to transmit what you're trying to say. And whether a per, an audience member understands music or not, they know what they like. I have to be honest, the fact that I had to struggle so hard to hear, like it just defeats the whole purpose. Thank you. Thank you very much for that. Mm -hmm. um, who did I miss? Anthony Michael Hobbs. Anthony Hyde, Hobbs. Do you have any feedback? Yes, um, pop on. Yeah, there's. I feel like there's really not much left today, and everyone really okay. said it all. You've heard, you've heard all the this, the audio issues. I'm not going to drag that out any further. Um, but yeah, I do agree with what everyone said. You can definitely feel the passion, and and you can tell how much this means to you when you when you sing it. You you can tell how important it is to you, and I think that it's, that's important. Yeah, Millie, I think it's pretty much you're hearing the same things we have. And this is all good stuff. If you want to you want to go next level, you're getting next level advice. So this is awesome. But like a, like I said, your passion, that was pretty amazing to watch you. I was like, I don't know what she's singing, but I believe in it. Whatever she said, check. All right. Moving on to the next thing. Congratulations for that. Um, our next guest is Angelic Voices featuring a sim. From, from New, New York. York. Angelic, Angelic voices? voices? Yes. You're, You're on. on. Okay, well. Thank you. Be sure, Be sure to, to unmute. unmute. Angelic Voices. Angelic Voices. Angelic Voices. And try to curse them daily. It's downright scary, deeply, really, clearly. We resist so they won't get near me. Hear me, cross the father. You were the author and the finisher, so your faith won't fail me. I'm in my element like Maurice Wright and Philip Bailey. Got that earth, wind, and fire. Do you feel me? It's a spiritual warfare. It's a spiritual war. It's a spiritual warfare. It's a spiritual war. It's a spiritual warfare. It's a spiritual war. What did God say? It's a spiritual war. Keep your guards up. It's a spiritual warfare. It's a spiritual warfare. 
It's a was hot wow uh, let me just jump right in uh, all right dr lee bailey please <laughs> i'm a little discombobulated now uh but the bottom line why are these dudes here they're i mean I, what what can you say they're ready i mean i love that song i love everything about it i i like what you guys are doing uh <sighs> I'd pay money to see you. I mean, I'm, I'm. They're trying to set the bar, Lee. Well, <laughs> bar set. Gonna be in trouble. <laughs> <laughs> bar set. Good feedback. All right, Doctor Mosley, please. Carrie Mosley. Me, Carrie Mosley Hobbs. I'm so sorry. I forgot we have a couple. No, no, no. It's fine. It's fine. I think it was a good song, and I appreciate the clear sound, and I was over here vibing with it, too. Yeah. All right. Aaron Akins? Uh, yes. Uh, same. Um, the level uh, was higher simply because I could hear everything. And... Um, yeah, it's is it, it uh, the content. I like the title. I like what you know, spiritual warfare. I like what they're trying to transmit. Though I remember them from last time. I, I just like what they're trying to do, and it meant a lot to be able to hear them. <laughs> that's it. Yeah, yeah. No, that's good stuff. That's excellent, Doctor Winston Greer. Please of that spiritual warfare that I think would be good, especially for rap. The other than that, it was great. Okay, thank you. Anthony? Anthony Hobbs? Uh, yeah, like everyone else said, like everyone said, it's, uh, uh, it's a really good song, really catchy. It, it makes you bump. And um, I think it, it's, uh, it says a lot, the fact that almost everyone in here does remember you guys. I think, I think, that 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 shows how much you stand out and, and how memorable you are and, and the mark that you leave on people. Very true. Very true. Good feedback. Thank you very much. Um Michelle. Yes, hi. Um, yeah, I do remember you guys from last time as well. And yeah, it's a, I thought it was a really great song, very catchy. I love the performance. I can see you guys performing this kind of all over. You know, a lot of people are feeling that right now on a spiritual level, like, oh, there's so much like stuff going on, you know? And and so the title is so pertinent to what a lot of people are feeling. And so I really do feel that it was a good song choice and you performed it really well. And the audio was really nice um as well and yeah good job guys <laughs> excellent excellent then we have Alander pulliam he, he'll be back but okay uh, the title that they uh have, have spiritual warfare is super powerful and on this end it was just a little difficult to hear the verses to hear the context of the verses supporting the title okay thank you but, pete uh, appreciate no that no worries. Keep up the good work. All right. Well, if there's nothing else, uh, gentlemen, that was fire. Thank you so much for being on. Appreciate you. All right. And best of luck to you. Um, we're going to move into our next act. Lil Heist is our next act from Wisconsin. Lil Heist, we already had a little taste. So let's Lil Heist once again. All right. Who is 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 Who is
kid, but he had a heart full of gold. Never was that good at school, but he was ill with the flow. Everybody around him told him to blow. Table from the chess pieces, but he made it look it. When you lost on them streets, it's really hard to find Jesus. His hustle kept him afloat like he was a G. Heavy move, he going back to him, to him like a frisbee. You feel me? Like bad perm. Steel wheel stuck on success, but can't turn. All these robots in his way, but stood firm. Respect is a given, it's something you must earn. If not, you gon' learn. Tied in, can't cry here. Gotta learn to accelerate. Who grind gears? Was a boy with a silver plate? Not round here, just a voice of one in a million. Welcome to the ghetto chill trend. I can't even believe that that's not already. I wow, wow, right, wow. Wait a minute, wait Thank a minute. You. I'm going first. You ain't got to call me. No, I, I go first. Go. Oh, hold on, Carrie. I'm, listen. What I really appreciate about Little Heist's work is that I always, to me, feel like music has this poetic influence to it, or this poetic point to it, where. It's not just that you take words and put it to a melody. And so you can repeat the same words over and over again. Yeah. But I want to feel like I want to sit in a dark room and get a story or a piece of poetry from you. And listening to that song, I was like sitting here with my head down not even looking at the screen because I wanted to hear the rest of the story that you was telling me. Yeah. And even then it was kind of like, I can even probably quote something. You was like turning bottom into a basement. Yes, I is and all that stuff. Like that's yeah. how close I was listening to you. And I was like, dang, love this. Thank you, thank you. Anthony Hobbs. my head this this like it, it feels like like real like like i'm like this something i would hear on the radio like this some that's trending on apple music like yeah, yeah this one got me hyped this one yeah uh yeah i rock with this thank you thank you thank you aaron okay okay it, so what i got from low heights right there is it seems like he put work in this like this is important to him you know, you can tell. You don't. You don't even have to be an artist, but you can tell that he put work into it, and it sounds, if not there, very close to artists that are out there. Uh, you know, I'm not a. I'm a, actually a jazz singer, so I'm not gonna pretend that I really know uh, rap the way some would. But I'm saying I know what I heard, 
and it really uh it really had some um professional qualities to it thank that's you. it thank you mm -hmm. dr bailey you've been around for a while give them some feedback <laughs> Well, thanks for making me feel older. Somebody got to be older than me on this platform. Somebody got to do it. So. <laughs> Young man. Wow. I am so impressed with you. If I could jump in, I could kind of fill you in what he's going through. Okay. Um, I have, uh, I manage a girl group. Uh, they're sisters. Two years, they're two years apart. They are streaming right now at, uh, a hundred thousand on one of their songs, one hundred and fifty thousand on on SoundCloud. They got one point six million on um on uh TikTok. They uh, eighty nine thousand or uh, eighty yeah eighty nine thousand on Instagram. And his it is it's, it's kind of what you were saying, like his representation. I know exactly what you're talking about. His his rep uh, his representation should be capitalizing that his music is being played on uh, played at the NBA games. Because um, when my artists started doing things with Nike JD Sport, we jumped on and had the publicist do a press release about that. They worked with them for over a year. Soon as their single hit uh, MTV Spanking New, we pushed that as hard as we could uh, with another press release. And we did a PR uh, drop through uh, different places to get uh, some more notoriety around it. And they're now, um, but as he's saying as well, I do understand him too, because a lot of places, in order to get yourself to grow, especially if you do not have a label behind you and you're doing it independent, it is very hard because a lot of these people are asking for money. Oh, thank you. I'm going to push along if nobody else has and any additional. And and Lil Heist, you you're always you just always bring it. I I it's going to happen for you, man. I just feel it. It's going to happen for you. I I'd, like, um, I'd like to. Oh, I'd like to yes, say, Yeah, I'd like to yes, jump something. Lil Heist, I just want to mention to you, man. In this industry, you got two kinds of records. You got a work record, and a record that got legs. That record you got got legs. Thank now, you. What you need to do is hold on to all your rights. Don't give anything away until you know the right deal is on the table. Okay? okay. Keep in mind, they're going for the top. When you're going for the top 10, the promotion dollars that are needed for something like that is almost a quarter of a million dollars. So if someone tried to offer you three grand or five grand, that ain't going to cut it. You see? Yeah. And you may want to in, induce what we call guerrilla marketing. Well, guerrilla marketing is having the nerve to go to the stations, start with your secondary stations first, you know, your P2 stations that are in the neighborhood, in the area, and and beg your way to get in there to see the PD or the MD, right? Yeah. And, and say, just like, hear, hear my record, because that, what you got there, somebody listen to the first eight bars, 16 bars, they're going to listen to the rest of it. Thank you. So man. Before, before you give away the store, keep that in mind because records with legs are really hard to come by, man. I'm just going to leave it there. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Pete. I just and thank you, little heist. One little thing. I know we've been on little heist and we've got to keep it moving, but I'll keep mine short and sweet real quick. I just wanted to say really thoroughly enjoyed it. I really did. I love the poetry. I love the performance. I loved the break where we all thought it was going to stop. And then you came back <laughs> in like, like I really, uh -huh. there was so much that I really liked about it. And it sounds like you've got a lot of people that really love it. Thank you for that, Michelle. Thank you. Thank you. Lil Heist, we love you. We're going to keep That's pushing. It. Thank you very much. And thank you for all of your feedback. This is great stuff. This, I'm sure all of the artists that are on are, are taking all of this in, or at least I hope so. Next up is our next impatiently waiting. Julian Gross is here out of Baltimore, was just there at Towson University a minute ago. Um, take me back home. Take me back home, Julian Gross. Stage is yours. You guys, my name is Julian Gross, representing Baltimore, Maryland. Um, getting ready to play an original for you guys. Um, it's called Water. Um, let's go ahead and get set up. Mm -hmm. 
Does this sound okay? I guess I've been in my race again Hard knock life getting harder But I just keep on running, I ain't finna miss a step I Gotta meet the man upstairs, show respects Cause I think something's in the water yeah. Cause I think something's in the water mm -hmm. Cause I think something's in the water mm -hmm. Cause I think something's in the water mm -hmm. I think something's in the world yeah. uh, I told my shawty why you playing Either help me or get out the way Headed to Atlanta cause I'm trying to make it out to A Thinking back to California Chilling on my balcony Just me and all my thoughts This is me and all my thoughts again Trying to find my way but truthfully I think I'm lost again Thinking how I'm supposed to raise a family What's the cost again? Breathing underwater Really I don't need no oxygen I only need my God up in the heavens Help me get about my ways again yeah. I knock life getting hard I knock life getting hard but I just keep on running, I ain't finna miss a step Gotta meet the man upstairs, show respects Cause I think something's in the water 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 I think something's in the hood hey. I think something's in the hood <laughs> Love it! Definitely. <laughs> yeah, yeah, definitely. Something <laughs> something in the water, for sure, for sure. Good song. Um, we're going to open it up to our panel. I uh, haven't heard from I'm trying to find Michael, Michael Ochoa. Yeah, sir. Uh, uh, great. I know the it's. I can't imagine how how, how difficult it is to play and sing your song. Uh, I watch my artists do. They just uh, they perform once. They just perform, but just to play an instrument and sing your song and be on uh, be on point with everything, and you know the the courage to do it and the nerve to get to get to make sure everything is right. Uh, you know that that's that's amazing, and then. Just the song that you picked is something that's phenomenal. I, I love guitar playing. I can't play myself, but I love to hear guitar. Thanks. Thank you. I'll go Thank next. You. Okay. Please do. Um, no, I thought that it was really good. It's Can you play covers? Covers to other music? Or you just play your own music? I can't hear you. You're on mute. Can you? Can hear you, Julian. And by the way, your your sound was good. Can you guys hear me better now? Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Can you hear me now? Yeah. 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 That feel like the whole time, like for the last fifteen to twenty minutes, I've been trying to decide: do I do an original song, being the one I just did, or uh, "So Sick" by Neo? I was gonna do that one as well. Um, yeah, I love cover tunes. I do them all the time. Those are usually what I get paid to do. Public. Thank you, Carrie, for that. I uh, haven't heard from Dr. Greer in a while. Winston, you still with us? Yes, ma'am. I'm still here. I, Any I, feedback I enjoyed, for Julian? I, I enjoyed it. Uh, the guitar uh, guitar playing is, is good to see uh, musicians uh, sing and do both. Um, I can't do neither, so y'all y'all inspired me to be able to see you all sing and play the guitar at the same time. I had brothers and sisters that that used to sing and play the guitar, so I'm almost I'm always amazed. Mm -hmm. 